What do I want to do before I die? I want to create something that's bigger than just one person or myself. Do you remember the last five TikToks that you watched? Video was a great opportunity to actually sell better. What's the crack? So, starting me off today in the west coast of Ireland here. Um, yeah, I guess I'm just gonna try and get this vlog going again. This is like numero three or something or four that I've tried to start and then I've, yeah, wanted to do it for years. But anyways, um, this will sort of document my process of trying to speak at VCon next year. It's a pretty ambitious goal, I know, but um, I'm gonna give it a, a go anyways and we'll see how it gets on. Peter McKinnon was the first guy I heard done is better than perfect and I've since heard it from a bunch of other creators so yeah just throw the content out there um, obviously I'd like to be I'd like it to be as good as possible but you know at the end of the day upload button just stick it up there so heading off to Dublin for an event blockchain event a few cool talks it looks like mostly in marketing that I'm interested in but well, we'll have a look and we'll see how it goes. This literally doesn't get easier. Like I've tried it a couple of times, uh, like this to the camera, like YouTube and stuff. And it, like it just, <laughs> every time it's like awkward as hell. You're constantly thinking like, oh, these people are freaking judging me like crazy. But I'm gonna head into this freaking event anyways, and we'll just see how it goes. And the theme for today is like, what do you wanna do? Or what do you wanna achieve before you die? So we'll give that a go. People need to know and understand what you do. If they go to your website, they can read content, but it's not as good as a video. A video can do it 10x better. We have to be adding value as marketeers in terms of entertainment, value in terms of information, or value in terms of education. This is like a big one floor, and then they've got all of the, the talks on in the same uh, sort of room as all of these. So. It's kind of noisy, rather than um, rather than being in a room where there's kind of silent. You kind of have to really pay attention to the speakers. What do you want to achieve before you die? I think I want to be in a position to really be able to help a lot of people. And what I mean by that is I've always received so much help from my teachers, my parents, even my neighbors. And so I've always wanted to provide that help in a form that I think you know, would make me feel like when I lived, I connected with other people, not just gotten a lot of stuff from them, but also I left something meaningful for them. Finding ways to develop uh, and communicate the brand's authentic value. Do you remember the last five TikToks that you watched? And I cannot remember the last five TikToks that I watched, but I guarantee you I watched at least 50 this morning and I don't remember a single one of them. So um, that's why it's so important to try and break through all of the noise out there. In Ireland, I've run more into, okay, you built the foundation, the house is up, you've decorated it, the lawn is planted, can we please close the business now? Pretty much exclusively at the social media stages, because that's the ones that I like. Um, yeah, it's all right, like, you know, uh, learning about different ways to engage online, uh, how to use your data, all that kind of stuff, all the good stuff. Yo, what's up guys? Here with two amazing people here, and we are asking them what they want to achieve before they die. So, what do you want to achieve before you die? I guess making a difference. I want to raise my family in a way that they are going to be happy and, um, and that's all. Well, if I were talking bucket list, I think I'd want someone to say, you're worth a statue. And, and that would be it. And I don't care where the statue would stand, but the statue would be of me and something I love. 1.3 million people use WhatsApp every day to communicate with their friends, family. Um, so your customers are on multiple platforms. So I start all my cold calls with, I was hoping you could help me. And when you do that, the person on the other end is like, can't hang up on him now. But it's very effective. We need to appeal uh, to interests rather than who somebody follows or what they, what they do. Right, yo, so like, there we are. 
that's the uh, conference over. My battery is literally about to die, so I think I got all the content that I needed. The last two um, things there where I got the what you want to achieve before you die, that was really good. So I'm glad I went up to that group. Anyways, yeah, I need to catch an old bus now. So, uh, yeah. Look.